hey rainbows and welcome back to another video in today's video we are doing something that was very highly requested by a lot of viewers i'm going to try the gender swap slash gender bend challenge i am going to be doing this with our royal family characters so it'll be a lot of fun we'll get to see a few of the characters as the opposite gender which i think would be really really cool so it's just gonna be a fun little video and i am excited i do have a quick request though before we begin one of my moderators and also a fellow simmer lily she's the one who built the willow creek and oasis springs royal palace from my royal family series but she is going through a really hard time right now guys and she really needs your help so make sure you guys go support lily i'll put the link to her gofundme in the description if you guys are able to donate or at least share it please at least share it if you're not able to donate then that would be fantastic i just want to make sure that we're there for her because she's been so great to me and this channel and just you guys too. I mean, she like answers a lot of your guys' questions in the comments as well. So don't forget to take a look at that. But if you're excited for this video, make sure you hit that like button and let's go ahead and begin. All right, so we're doing four different royal family characters for this gender swap challenge. If you're new to my channel and this is the first video you have seen, I have a royal family series on my channel, which I will link in the description below. I have two seasons. The second season you are able to watch without having seen the first season. And it is also, just the more recent season because there's a hundred episodes in the first season so just so you know so I'll link both of those in the description below so you can see but we are going to be doing this gender swap makeover for Princess Amira, Prince Jabari, Princess Kimberly, and Prince Cornelius so I picked a lot of different sims who I really wanted to see as the opposite gender. I'm only going to be picking a formal outfit for each of them so it's not going to be a super long video but I'm so excited, you guys. I'm so excited to do this. Okay, so I basically all we have to do is just swap the gender here on each of the characters. Oh my god. Okay, all right, Amira. Okay, so... <laughs> this is a horrible way to start, you guys. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna just get rid of the skin details that I have for now and I'll add those later. First thing I want to do... Um, one, get rid of the facial hair and also change her or his hair now because I don't love this. Should we pick like a name that would go for each of them too? I'm trying to think of a name. Oh, when we did the video where we saw like the kids that had never been born sort of thing, like couples that never happened, their kids. I think Amira's was named Adam. I don't know. That's not like a male version of Amira, but maybe just for this, we're going to do Prince Adam Windenberg. Okay. Oh my gosh. This does look like a mirror though. Like I was worried that it was just gonna change the hair too much, but this really does look like a mirror. I actually love this hairstyle. I used this hairstyle for a lot of my Windenburg Royal family, but Amira had wavy hair. So I feel like he should also have wavy hair. I love this hair, to be honest. It's a little bit more messier than like a prince's hair, but I think it looks really good. So yeah, we're gonna go with that hair. The eyebrows, I don't know. These look a little funny. Is that what our original eyebrows looked like? Okay, I think I'm gonna go, I don't know. These eyebrows might be too perfect. Maybe I'll change them later, but this is taking too long. So I'm just gonna go with these eyebrows for now. And then I am going to do the face mask that I had for Amira. So yes, please. Yes, that one looks so much better. I love this face mask. It's called Satin Finish by Hayden, it looks like. That, I used it, oh no, no, not that one. Yeah, I used this one for all of them. It looks awesome. Oh my gosh, this is so weird, you guys. It's so weird to see this. Okay. And then like, I also really love to do a nose mask. I really love this one. I'm gonna do this nose mask. Yeah, that one matches perfectly. Okay, cool. Okay, so I am doing like the fancy clothing, like their formal outfits. So why don't we go ahead and do that? I mean, he would be a king if, if this was Avira as a boy, they would I guess technically be king. Or I guess right now he would be a prince. Yeah, okay, so let's do a prince version of him for now. Or no, should we do a king? Let's just do a king version. I'm sorry, I'm making this way too complicated. Let's do a king version of him. Okay, so there is that outfit. This is all is from Bruxel. I think that's how you say it, on The Sims Resource. So I use a lot of these outfits for King Henry. So there's this one, it just like has a sword, but that's fine. I think this works. And then I need to just change his shoes into something fancier. and. And then we need a crown. So let's go ahead and do that. This, oh gosh, okay, no. Oh man, am I gonna, I'm gonna have to change his hairstyle, aren't I? 
Yeah, that's fine. There's this one, this little curly one from the Realm of Magic pack. I don't know, the hair has to be like completely slicked back for it not to clip onto that crown. I actually, I don't, I don't hate that. I don't know. I wish I was doing this, like, I wish I was streaming this so you guys could actually tell me what you think because I'm unsure of how I feel. The back is clipping, but it's fine. You know what? It's totally fine. Oh my gosh, you guys, this is crazy. And she doesn't, like, just look like King Henry. Like, I was wondering if she would, but Amira's face, like, a lot of her face is from her mom, so I guess it makes sense that she doesn't just, or that he doesn't just look like King Henry. You can see some King Henry in there, though. I don't mind this. This is pretty cool, actually. All right, next we are going to turn Prince Jabari into a female. So let's go ahead and see what that looks like. Whoa, this outfit though. Okay, cool. I feel like we could literally do like, oh no, it's not gonna all fit in here though. Can we do like Jabri? I don't know. I honestly don't even know if this is actually a name, but I think it works. So we're doing her formal outfit. So that, well, I mean, they got the long hair, but I want to do a different hair for sure. I always, I feel like eyebrows make such a difference. So let me pick something that actually works. I feel, okay, yeah, that works perfectly. Okay, and then let's go ahead and change your hair. I always love this hair. This is one of my favorites. I feel like I use it a lot. Like literally Princess Kimberly is wearing this one right now. So let's do something else. I really like this one actually. We'll have to see if it works with whatever crown or tiara I use, but I think this one works great. So I'm gonna use this. I actually don't think I've used this for any of my Sims before. I don't actually know if she has any, I think she does. She has some skin details on already. No, no, she does not. Okay, oh, cool. Oh, that looks so much better, you guys. Did I not have a skin detail on Prince Jabari? I'm definitely gonna do that after this video. Oh my gosh, you guys, she looks really pretty. I haven't even done all the makeup yet and she already looks gorgeous. I'm so excited. Okay, so let's do some makeup. We'll do some of my favorite highlighter. I really love this one. I use this one a lot too. So there's, there's actually that looks pretty good. And that also adds some blush on her too. All right. And then we'll do some eyelashes as well. Oh gosh, that's a lot. Let's do this. Yeah. Lots of lashes. That looks super cute. This is like, oh gosh, one of my favorite eyeshadows. It just makes their eyes look so much bigger. I actually really love this one too, because this is about to be a formal outfit. So we'll do that one. And this is one of my favorite lipsticks as well. Should we go with something a little bit more subtle? I like this one actually. That looks really pretty. Oh my gosh, you guys, she looks gorgeous. Like I can't take this. Okay, that's like the makeup and everything. I'll do jewelry in a second, but I wanna pick out a dress and stuff. So I'm gonna get rid of these random accessories that she has. So let's find a good dress. Should I, I, I feel like I should dress her in a Selva Dorada themed outfit because that is where Prince Jabari is from. I actually downloaded this one, which I think is gorgeous. I was saving this for Queen Samora at some point. Yeah, I think this one looks the best. And I love this purple because the Windenburg colors are purple. And then let me add some jewelry. So as far as crowns though, I don't think I've found one yet that I like for Selva Dorada. So I don't even know if we're gonna be able to put her in a crown, but at least some like really nice earrings or something. Oh, there's those. That might work. That matches the outfit. Oh no, these. I feel like that works. That works perfectly. Yeah, let's just do that one. Okay, and then as far as crowns go, I mm, I don't really have anything. We can still put her in a crown though, at least. Like, I don't know. I mean, I don't, this, like this doesn't really go, but it's a, it's, oh, that one's actually really pretty. I feel like that wouldn't be their crown. Like that's much more of like a European crown, but I think it's fine. There's also these ones too. Ooh, yes. There's these. I think this one looks the best. I don't know. Uh, yeah, I think this one looks the best. I'm gonna go with that one. Although her earrings don't match, so I'm just gonna make her earrings silver. So at least that matches. Oh, guys, that looks really pretty. I like this. Oh my gosh, this is Prince Jabari as a woman. This is awesome. Oh, I love this. Okay, this is so much more fun than I thought it would be. Okay, so next we're doing Princess Kimberly. I picked Princess Kimberly specifically because I am very curious if she's just gonna look like her father because I think a lot of her features are from her father, but I'm curious to see like what she has from her mother. So we're gonna turn Prince, okay, okay. What 
what is a good prince name for Kimberly? Let's see, maybe like Cameron or something, but I can spell it with a K. So Cameron, Prince Cameron. So, oh, whoa, guys, I don't think he just looks like his father. I don't know. The bow tie is kind of distracting. Let me just change that real quick before I change his hair. Okay, I will change his outfit later. But yeah, let me find a good hair. I might just keep the eyebrows because I think those are fine. Kimberly has curly hair. I mean, like she didn't really when she was a child, but like I think the curly hair just fit her so much better when she grew up. So we're going to do something with curly. This might actually be her brother, Prince Manuel hair. This is actually her father's hair or Princess Kimberly's father's hair, Prince Philip's hair. I think it looks really good on her. Oh, there's this one too. That's just a shorter version of it. Why don't we do this one? So it's just not directly like her father's hair. Okay. I actually think I'm going to change the eyebrows. Let's go with these. I think these are okay. Okay. Oh, he's cute. Okay. Um, let's do, um, so Oasis Springs culture is inspired by Indian culture. So why don't we do, ooh, one of my favorite outfits is this one. This is like an outfit that I've gotten pretty recently that if you watch my series, you've probably seen Lord Gabriel wear a lot. I've also put Prince Manuel in some of these outfits too. Ooh, this one's my favorite. Let's do this one. I like this. Oh my gosh, yes. Also, if you are curious and if you have not seen before, I have some royal custom content videos. So I will link those in the description. I have one that's a little bit more European themed custom content that has like a ton of custom content. And then I have one that is just geared more towards the seven different kingdoms that I have in my series. So I will link those in the description below. This is Princess Kimberly as a boy, which is really, really cool to see. I love this guys. Cause you can still see them in like in the faces and everything. Okay. So the last one we're going to do here is Prince Cornelius. So I feel like I could kind of change it to Princess Corinne, although I don't know if that's all going to fit. I could even do Cora, honestly, if we want to do like his grandmother's name. Let's do Princess. Let's do Cora because I don't think Corinne's all going to fit in there. So we'll do Princess Cora and then we're going to change it. Oh gosh. Oh my God. You know what? I should have realized this before. I think he's just going to look like his sisters. I think so. I don't know. Oh gosh. Sorry. That's my dog. I think though we can make an angst. Uh, I don't know. It doesn't look exactly like his sisters. I think we could just make, oh my gosh, those eyebrows though. This is insane. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Cornelius, your eyebrows were crazy. Oh my gosh. We could definitely do a very bitter <laughs> and angsty girl version of Cornelius. So that should be fine. Okay. I don't, I don't know about these eyebrows. Let's do these. They look like a little bit much, but it's fine. It'll be okay. Okay. And then let's do, I don't even know if I did the skin details on Kimberly slash Cameron. So this is with skin details. Oh my gosh, I cannot get over this, you guys. I actually don't mind this hair. This actually, this looks pretty good. Have I used this hair? I don't know. Oh my gosh, the lips. The lips are so like narrow and shrewd. Like it just, I don't know. He would make such a good witch. Okay, let's do a formal outfit. Uh, this formal outfit is looking a little bit crazy. And let's pick a dress. So let's do one of the Royal Willow Creek gowns. This is actually a new gown that I saw. I don't know how I feel about it yet though. So this is one, but I feel like he needs, or she needs something a little bit more angsty-ish. Oh my gosh, there's this one. It kind of looks like a witch outfit. Uh, I don't know. I don't know if I want to go that far. Okay, let's do this dark blue, I think. I might change it later. We will have to see. And then since it's a formal outfit, I did I even know that Cornelius had these birthmarks and smoles on his face? I don't even know if I did, but I don't mind them. Okay, let's do an updo just because it's the formal outfit. Oh, this one's a new hairstyle that I got. Oh, you guys, I love this, but I'm trying to make it into like an angstier teenager. But I feel like this could kind of be like, I don't know what the word is I'm going for here. Okay, so I kind of like this one, this hair style. I still don't know how I feel about the dress. So I think I'm going to change this. Oh my God. What about, what about this one? Okay. She kind of looks like, like she could be a witch or a wizard or a spellcaster or something just because the dress is like very medieval. I actually really love this dress. I think I'm going to go with that. I forgot to put like a makeup and stuff on her though. So let's do some eyelashes. I think I want to go for some, yeah, let's go with these eyelashes. And then, yeah, I kind of want to go for like a dark queen, like this 
really red lipstick. Oh my gosh, what? She looks like a villain out of a movie. This is great. I kind I want to do like my, oh God, no. I don't know how I feel about that. Never mind. Okay, let's do something else. I feel like this blue works great. This blue works perfectly. And then let's do some contour. A little too much contour. Let's do this highlight. This one, I think, works. Mm, no, I think the contour might actually work. Okay. I don't know if this is too much makeup. Is that too much? Yeah, let's go with this. I don't think that she needed the blue eyeshadow. So let's go with this eyeshadow. It's so very like dark and, and, and shadowy. Okay. And then let's do some earrings. So I feel like some really nice jewelry. Oh my God. I cannot get over this. You guys, <gasps> I can't get over this. Oh my gosh. This is so cool. Okay. Let's do the matching necklace. <gasps> Oh my God. Wait, no, do we want to do something darker than this? Oh, like a choker necklace or something? Ooh. Oh, there's this one. <gasps> do, do we like that? I don't know. I kind of want to do something a little bit darker than that. Do we want to do like something from the vampire pack? Something like this or like this? Ooh. <gasps> oh my gosh. Oh, this is cool. Oh, ha. I don't know. How do we feel about that? I don't know. I keep asking you guys. You guys aren't here to tell me. You guys have to tell me in the comments below. This is literally like a vampire queen. I love this. I think I'm gonna keep that necklace. I don't think the earrings go 100% because the necklace is Maxis and then the earrings are alpha. So let's do like these black earrings. I think that goes well. Yeah, I feel like the black goes fine. Okay, <gasps> okay. Oh, she needs a crown. She definitely needs a crown, like a vampire crown. Have I, what is this? Have I not, I, this is, no. Okay, so there's like these crowns, but I feel like this is too, light like I feel like it needs to be like a dark crown which I don't think I have like there's this one too but I think that's a little bit too light like compared to the necklace that she has on or there's a small mm, no that's still too light I think this one might be the best one because it's not like too light this is made by normal sims by the way which I think they have a tumbler so this I feel like this works yeah like the crown and everything I need like a vampire crown like something dark that they could wear I know they have them I just have never had any use for them so I don't download them but guys, okay, I think that's it. I think that's everybody. So I'll put some screenshots here so you guys can see all of them. I actually really love the way that they turned out. I would love to do this challenge again in the future. If you guys want me to do specific Sims in the future, leave that in the comments below so I can come back to this and look at that so I know for future videos. If you have other suggestions for challenges, you can leave that in the comments below as well. If you enjoyed this, make sure you hit that like button. If you have not already, hit that subscribe button and turn on your notifications. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.